here I'm in, in my personal email here and all you have to do is select the email that came in from me from Dropbox and you'll select that and the reason it says Park Springs is because that's my old, the old church name but it should say your name there hi whatever your name is or your email address um, Matt invited you to a Dropbox shared folder called December 22nd choir music the reason it's called that is because when I created it that's what I named it and apparently once you create a shared folder um, I can't change the name of it on my end but you can change it on your end so uh, I'll show you how to do that in a second <clears throat> so you'll go ahead and hit view folder and then it will take you to this website um, if you already have a Dropbox account you'll just sign in uh, if you do not have a Dropbox account it's completely free um, I you know the only way to access the files is to create one so um, you just click right here create an account and you put your name your first name your last name your email address and create a password and um, that's it's as easy as that and then boom you're in so um, since I already have one I'm going to go ahead and log in here <clears throat> this um, invitation will show up and you just hit accept excuse me accept all right and now I'm inside so this is the parent folder as, as it were and these are the subfolders that are inside the parent folder you can go up by selecting this button right here and it will show you all your photos or excuse me all your folders and um, so you're gonna click on this one December 22nd choir music that's the one now if I were you I would rename it and how you do that is you right click and rename and then I would just change it to FBC choir or whatever you want to whatever you want it wow if I could spell there you go FBC choir let's do this FBC F choir <coughs> shared folder okay so but you have to change it on your end I can't change it so there you go and once you're in there uh, there's the information packet um, and then this is where I'll have your music so this is going to be all the music for March 2nd yeah it's all right there um, you know you click on the individual song name and it have all your files um, if it ends in .mp3 that means it's an audio file for you to listen to so the audio tra or the alto track there soprano track, tenor track, you also have sheet music SAT stands for soprano alto tenor um, and you've got your lyrics right here and all you need to do to download them on your computer is you can select the files like this um, you can click on it right here but it's just gonna play inside of your browser um, so you, unless you want to listen to it just from the internet um, I don't recommend you do this so um, and it created a new tab so I'm gonna uh, get out of that but this is how I recommend you do it you just right click and then you can hit download and it'll download same thing with lyrics if you want to view them online you just click it and it'll just it'll just view the file in your browser and you can close or if you want to download it actually onto your computer right click and hit download and that's how you put files on your computer